so you're getting hit with that dopamine on on Instagram. So at first you are, but here's how you know dopamine, and it's this will give you a window into addiction. If you're if you're not an addict, you'll be able to sympathize with maybe even empathize with addicts. When you first get on social media, you're excited. Maybe you or Joe or somebody has a new podcast out, right? You know, you're excited. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. That's dopamine. You're motivated. But if you ever find yourself doing a behavior and you kind of don't know why you're doing it, like this doesn't feel any good anymore. Like, yeah, hey, your heart's not in. Like, what? why am I here? Why am I, what am I doing? I'm not even getting any pleasure, but here I am like a, you know, rat pressing a lever. Well, that's the dopamine system has been depleted. And so what you need is some time away from it. Could be 10 minutes, could be 10 days. And then it feels good again. True for relationships, true for exercise. You know, I believe in training hard and training often, but if you train too hard too often, you can't bring the intensity that you need to get the stimulus to adapt and pretty soon you're either plateauing or you're getting worse. 